So I was just made aware that apparently the Japanese website for Shin Megami Tensei 5 was mistakenly updated to include the release day of Thursday, November 11th, 2021. This error was quickly undone and it doesn't display as of this current moment in time. The people at Persona Central got hold of this information and published it on their website, so thanks to them for finding this. This most likely means that Shin Megami Tensei 5 will be a part of Atlas's E3 lineup and be presented sometime during the convention. They also leaked a bit more information than just the release day, so I'll read it out to you guys. The description of the game is the latest mainline title in the Shin Megami Tensei series. Since Shin Megami Tensei's first release in 1992, the series has gained in popularity for its dark worldview, anarchic scenarios, and original combat systems with demons and deities as allies. Shin Megami Tensei 5 combines the unique charm of the series with high quality visuals of the latest hardware. The game will deliver a new demon experience like never before. The story's main character, a high school student, living an ordinary life, wanders into another world called the R. The hero fuses with a mysterious man and becomes a Nabino, a forbidden being throwing himself into a battle between gods and demons. In the mysterious world, the R, where desert is found all over various gods and demons are scattered about, including demons as large as mountains and giant birds flying in the sky. As you explore the R, you will face over 200 demons. In addition to familiar demons, several demons newly drawn by Masayuki Doi, the character designer of this title, will also appear. The art, an untamed land, is under attack by powerful demons. The protagonist clears his way through to pursue the truth. Make use of various means to advance, such as growing the power of Nalbino, and sometimes utilizing the power of the demons themselves. The end of the game can diverge in many ways. What is the future that you will choose? There is a limited edition on its way to Japan, but we don't know if it's coming to the West, so we'll just assume that it's staying in Japan for now, just like the Nocturne one. We know that the game is releasing on November 11th, 2021, according to this, and it will cost 9,878 yen on release in Japan. And that's basically all the news. Hope you guys are hyped and enjoyed this news just like I did. What do you guys think about this? Let me know in the comments section down below. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe for more content from your average resident. And with that all being said and done, my name is Res Unleashed. The resident who saw this information needed to make this video very quickly and unleash it out into the world for you all to see. And I will catch you all next time.